Alright. Um. Some people don't like the. Um. Oh, what's the name of it? CPXR. For. Well. I don't really know why they wouldn't like it. I mean. This is a really, really good helmet. If you want a helmet that's. Like. Really cool. Like, real cool looking. And, um. It is one of the best protected helmets. Um, then you should get the Cascade CPXR. Right there. It's well, I'm I'm gonna get mine changed. Like I'm gonna have it fixed because I know someone that can get it fixed. Um, I'm gonna have someone punch the rivets out. And change the visor to blue, cause I'm going to be playing for the Broomfield Bobcats, um, Colorado. If you know who they are, that's the team I'm going to be playing for. Um, I'm going to take off this mohawk, put that blue, and um, have that change to blue, and then I'll just get a new tin strap. It's got a um, silver chrome face mask. It's actually real nice. Like, the face mask looks just... I don't know. It's just cool. Um, it, I don't know. I just, like, really like the top for some reason. Like, I like that little fin that's in the back. I call it a fin, but it's not. Um, and then, uh, when I told my stepdad about it, or about the helmet, because I wanted to get it, um, I told him that these little, like, little pipe-looking things in there. I, I told them that they look like little exhaust pipes, so, like, if you're fast, they like, shoot out smoke and stuff from it. Um, and then this is the team that I did play for. I thought we were going to be a team again, but CYLA didn't let us because of uh, kids. Like the age kid of kids, we um my high high plans has been around for like uh two three years. Like the team, um we were okay the first year and then we were really good the second year. Um, I believe we only lost five games out of like the forty that we played. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna be playing for the Bobcats now, so that's gonna be a B. And then on the back, I need to take that. Oh yeah, okay. Might as well take it off now if I can. Hold on. Alright, here we go. We're good now. I took it off. Um, and then in this little space, it's gonna have it's gonna say Bobcats going across. Um, and this is a really nice helmet. Like it looks good, um good protection and some people like the Pro 7s better, but, I mean, they are good helmets. Pro 7s are good helmets. Um, they look good, too. Like, they, I don't know, they're just, like, they're cool looking. Um, but, if CPXRs are better. Um, and if you want to argue, go ahead and argue down in the comments, and I'll be fine with that. Um, I have no problem with that so yeah you can feel free to do that um but this is this video isn't just on the cpxr so i'm gonna get my shoulder pads um they're to me they're like one of the best shoulder pads um that you could get and uh, i have to take the penny off um, uh, right now, I'm, ha I'm, like, I'm halfway done with an indoor season for Parker, the Parker indoor lacrosse, it's got a helmet, I'm going to mistake, I'll take the jersey off so you can see the padding, um, these are, um, kind of pop, these are pretty popular shoulder pads, and 
I can leave. And they're just really good, so that I mean that's why they're pop so popular. Um, they are Maverick shoulder pads. I'm gonna take these off for the spring. Um, I've already well, I didn't I didn't notice that, but I already kind of tore it. But oh well. Um, they're really good shoulder pads. Um, right there, it's like really hard plastic. Um, and this is like really hard, uh, like kind of hard, hard foam, I guess you can call it. It's got a centerpiece, really hard. Um, if I get hit at all, it, I can barely feel it. Like, these are really good pads. But, um, like yesterday I had to practice without arm pads. Um, to me, I'm, I'm like really used to it. So it, it really doesn't hurt at all. Um, actually it doesn't even bother me to get whacked in the arms quite a bit, um, without any arm padding there. So, I mean, I'm, I'm fine getting hit, or I'm fine using, um, no arm pads. It's like really cushiony there, like, that's, I don't know, I just like that. Um, I believe these are the pads that Rabel used, or used, Paul Rabel, um, Boston Canyons. Like he signed a contract with Warrior now, so he's not wearing anything Maverick anymore. Um, it was either these or something really close. Um, it's kind of cool. Like Maverick signed. Really hard. Um, these are good shoulder pads. I got um I ordered these online, but I also got the Maverick gloves and the Maverick arm pads that came with it. Um. And, yeah, I really like the Maverick gloves. Like, they got, like, this clear, kind of hard gel stuff on them. That is real cool. And they're all shiny. I've had these for, uh, since last season. Yeah, since the beginning of the last season is, when I, is how long I've had these. Before that, I had really crappy shoulder pads. Like, they were just real cheap. Um, then... Yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, but whoever wants to play for the Broomfield Bobcats and you're in Colorado, uh, sign up now. And we need a goalie, so if someone's a goalie out there and you want to play for the Bobcats, Colorado Broomfield. Not like there are other there's other Broomfields, so that's why I'm just saying that. Uh, that's why I'm saying Colorado. So, yeah, the uh, the Broomfield Bobcats, Colorado. We need a goalie. So, yeah, this hasn't been in a while, in a video in a while. I don't use this, but I'm gonna use it in my last indoor game, like uh, like retro kind of um, SCX Axe Shaft. You'll know from my other videos, regular mesh. Uh, Hard mesh, three uh, throwing strings across. Nike Legacy, red chrome, 2010. This is a really good head. I I really like this head. Um, I'm gonna get a restrung with a, a dog rocket pocket. Um, I read on the thing. Um, I looked at on uh, some things on the internet and the little manual that came with my. Uh, classical rocket pocket um, and says that it has like a faster shot and I'm an attackman and I look for and I uh, and that, that's what I look for um, but I, I do need um, I do pass quite a bit so I mean yeah it, it it'll help with passing a little bit but um yeah, it, just a faster shot is what I'm looking for. I, I don't shoot that fast. Um, like shoot almost sixty. Yeah, almost sixty. The last time I did the faster shot, it was with um my stepdad's friend's rocket pocket. Um, and here's a the stick that I use now, classical pocket. Um, 
you'll see from my other video, I did a whole bunch, I did all, all my six, um, but, the, I used my stepdad's friend's classical rocket pocket, it was like, on a warrior head, like a titanium shaft, it was real light, it was, it was really nice, I really liked it, I mean, I had like the, it was like that, for the butt, but it was tape, um, but, found a shaft that was real light, real nice, green, I couldn't find a green shaft anywhere, um, and I had that, and I really liked that, um, and it doesn't come off like rubber, <laughs> unless if you, like, mess it up real good, um, but, yeah, he let me use it, and I did the fastest shot competition, and, um, I got, what was it, 51 miles an hour, my friend got 52, but I had to, I had to shoot, like, 10 times, because they never recorded it, so I could have gotten faster, but you never know, because they didn't record it, um, but yeah, this is on the stallion, white on the top, like, if you have it, that, white on the top, force green, um, yeah, that's, that's about it. Um, yeah, I don't really have anything else to say. Um, but I've seen videos on people, like, saying, like, like, a vi like videos on, like, which one is better, CPXR or Pro 7. And for me, it's definitely 100% CPXR over the Pro 7. Uh, I do like Pro 7s, but I'm just going to go with CPXR because they're just a whole lot better. Um, so yeah, that's about it. Uh, I'll try to make some more lacrosse videos. So, yeah. Peace.